Hi, this is Ross with My Service Depot, and today we're going to go over how you can create a new report to keep track of your technician's iFleet clock in and out times through the Smart Service Report screen. Now we first start by coming to the Reports icon. Now once you click on it, you have all these different categories. Now we don't actually have the category yet for the mobile workforce, so we actually have to create that. So from here, we click on the New Reports option to the top left. Now this brings us into the customized report screen. Now on the right hand side, we're going to go over here and we're going to scroll down until we see that mobile workforce daily summary category. And you just can come to the left and type in what you want to call this report. We're just going to call it the clock in and out report. And then come down here to field name. This is where we can select what information we want to display onto the report. So let's go ahead and get everything added. Now we're one field short, but what we can do to get that last few gallons in is come up here to portrait and switch us to landscape. So now it gives us two additional fields. So now we can add that last field. And I want to go ahead and sort this. So we're going to sort this by the actual scheduled date. So once you actually have everything situated in here, all we have to do now is click Save and Close towards the top right. So now on the left hand side, you can now see our Mobile Workforce Daily Summary category. And once you click on it, it now shows us that new report we just created. Now to view this, all you have to do is click on the first icon. This is what actually brings you into your report and shows you all the different clock in and out times for your technicians. Now this is going to be you know, hundreds and thousands of pages eventually. We need to filter this information down. So that's where this fourth icon comes into play. This is where you can break it down and see one particular employee for a week or even a month of range if you need to. Now to apply the filters, we just click on the fourth icon, come in here and we want to see a specific person. So we're going to click assign device equals and we pick that person. You even have the ability to come in here and select dates if you wanted to. We can say, you know, date equals one value, or even come in here and select a whole date range if you wanted to. So if I want to see just this month or this quarter or even this year, you select your values and then click preview. So this now will bring you into report and now show you all the clock in and outs for your employee. Now for more info, go to smartservice.com or follow us on Facebook and Twitter with the links below.